Hey everybody, I'm here with Cody Neville, who is our horse, Philippe, in Beauty and the Beast. You got it. It's been a while since we did a Raw, a backstage uh, show, uh, because Casey asked me to make sure we didn't give away any of the tricks of Beauty and the Beast <laughs> until it was nearly over. So we're going to put a couple together right now. So Philippe the horse is a man Correct. inside of a... Big contraption. As you can see, the horse is almost life size. Um, it's very soft on the outside and we get into the horse from the bottom and as you can see it's mostly like a backpack like structure that we get into. We have pieces that hold around our waist so that we can control our body as well. And, and I'm you become the front legs of the horse. Correct. Yep, we're in boots and brown pants so we kind of blend in and black so that we blend in in the horse as well. As you can kind of see inside there's a lot of, a lot of working pieces as well as a microphone because we make the horse's sounds as well while we're out on stage to kind of interact with the uh, actors. So we're going to show you how we get in and some of the, the pieces with Philippe. So coming through the bottom here. Come up on the inside. Do you usually have someone help you? Oh, you're fine. Who <laughs> knows what they're doing? <laughs> Quickly get strapped in. All right. And then our hands actually come up through the neck piece. And so we'll kind of show you one at a time. So the first thing are the ear pieces. We have a left and a right. And as we squeeze, those are like a brake feature. And as we squeeze those, you can see from the front, the ears will move and I can do them independently of each other. Easy okay. to get a lot of reactions from the And then you're just themselves. moving your wrists back and forth to move the head. Correct, yep. I can just move my hands and wrists to make the head shake yet or no. We can make it up and down to shake yes. Okay. All right, the next thing would be the eyelids. They do just a small amount of movement with this little lever. You can see just a little bit, but enough to for people to notice. And poor Philippe is very cross-eyed, <laughs> wall-eyed, actually. Yes, he really is. All right, and the next are the eyes. These are on a, you have to spin them with your wrist um, to make the eyes go back and forth. Do that again. Oh, there we go. You can see this do a little bit of movement there, so. All right, and the next thing would be the mouth. And the mouth is actually on a little push bar. You just push forward with your thumb. And I do this when I'm trying to show that I'm eating out of a, out of a little uh, barrel or a pail on the side of the stage. And the front, you can see it looks like he's just chewing. <laughs> I have not noticed his, his job stuff, before. So. Those yeah. teeth are terrible. I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. So just on that. And the last thing that we have control over would be the tail. And you can see, this is kind of a little harder piece to see. But it is a little wire piece that's strung all that's the way right. back. Yep, right here. And it's strung all the way back to the tail. And as we move back and move forward, you can see the tail does a little bit of a, a, bit of a reaction. Very cool. So those are the main pieces of Philippe. So and to get him in and out is very challenging. It takes me plus two other assistants to guide the back piece and to help me see because my, my vision in the front is very limited. But <laughs> it's How fun. much do you think it weighs when you're wearing it? <sighs> I mean, it's an equivalency because yep. it's got support in the back. On the shoulders itself, you're probably looking around 50 to 60 pounds, but pulling it, it probably is a good uh, 150 to 200. Because once you're out there, you're pulling it alone. Yep, it's all manpower. There's nothing, nothing behind there See, that helps it on and off. Queen Elizabeth wore a dress in the Pirate Queen that was 50 pounds. Oh, so wow. you can handle this. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. Coming up inside. Alex always puts me on Snapchat, so this is only fair. Oh, whatever, true though. <laughs> I end up doing some stupid gesture or something, and all of a sudden, right on my famous story. I'm famous. <laughs> so, what did you use the stool for, though? Seriously? Um, not yet. It'll be used in a second. Oh, oh, to get the weight off. Yep. Look at that. See how smart I am. Jeez. Now, I asked Casey just the other day what this stuff is made out of—the horse. Oh, I don't even know. You know what? Clear? Okay. Got that? I'm just too short. Okay. Does Tyson just stand on his toes or something? Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, he does. Yeah, he does. <laughs> oh, you're pulling. I was like, what's it doing? Like, okay, here we go. Now we'll check it out on stage. <laughs> Genius. <laughs> What's a genius?
cheese. And no, now who? I want you to go out into the woods and bring me back the biggest, healthiest deer you can find. Oh, not the woods. Anything but the woods. You know I hate the woods. Just get me a deer for my wedding. Please. But I hate the woods. It's dark and spooky and there's bugs and spiders. Papa, are you all right? Oh, I'm fine, but I can't for the life of me figure out why that happened. If this isn't the stubbornest piece of... Junk. Michael Fox, do you have the right to have that camera back there? Quack, 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 quack. <laughs>